Okay, so today I'm going to make a purple and orange um, bluegill popper and we're going to start out with a size 12 hook and some um, fire orange thread, it's 140 ultra thread and we're just going to start out by covering our hook with orange thread Over. Snip your end off. And then you're going to take um, medium hollow purple tinsel. Um, Flashaboo. Flash really great stuff. And you're going to attach it onto your hook. And you're going to move your thread all the way up to the front, but make sure that when you attach the purple, you cover all of the purple, or almost all of it. And then you move your thread back to the beginning. So, after you have attached your purple flasher boo, you're going to take um, a feather or a piece of a turkey feather. Um, and I like the turkey feathers because they're really stiff and straight. Take that and you might have to fold it if you cut it too thick and you're just gonna attach that Make sure that you have no pieces sticking up. You can even cut your pieces to make sure that they won't stick up. Make sure it's good and in there. And if your tail is too long, you can just snip it right off so that you have a little piece. And you're going to move your thread all the way forward. And then you're going to take your purple flushaboo and you're going to make sure that it doesn't clamp your tail down. And you're going to just wrap it still leaving some of the orange to where you can see it and then once you're done with that you're going to take your orange and you're going to secure that purple And then you can snip it off once you have attached it. Okay. Now you're going to take um, some black feathers um, that look like this. And you're going to take a little bit off of the end. So it looks like that. And if it's long, it's okay. We'll fix that later. And 
and you want to make sure that it stays on the top. You can roll it. Make sure that it stays where you want it. Now, this fluff, you can just bend it over and tie that right there. And then, you want this to be short, so you can just take your scissors, snip it, and I like mine to stand up because I think it looks more like a bug, so press the hairs back and make a few wraps and come forward, make a few wraps and just keep doing that. But make sure that you don't put the um, thread over the eye because that wouldn't work. And now, you can just tie it off. And I'm just doing a wet finish with my hands. You can do wet finish with the tool or another knot if you know another one. make a couple and then after you've made your knots you can cut that line and um, if you want you can head some in it but I'm not going to do that with this one. Um, and there is your bluegill popper. I've caught a couple of bluegills on this. Um, it works really well. So, hope you guys catch a lot of fish off of it. And so, thanks for watching. Bye. Let's go look at it. Okay, Ann. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And by a little bit, did you ever say anything to Pat?